Hey there, YouTube. Let's pick something up there today. It's a, uh, I guess, I don't know, Geiger counter, whatever, for radiation. And it's obviously from Russia or something. I'll shut that TV off for a sec. So, yeah, anyways. Um, just want to show you guys that it works. It actually makes a tone. I don't know if you can hear that tone, but um, right now it's, I mean, it's beeping, you know, I don't know, like, not constantly, but it's beeping, you know, several times a minute or whatever. But I got a clock here. It's the old Big Ben. And uh, in case you don't know, the glowing hands and stuff like that have radiation. And um, all the Swiss Army watches there, they kept them in the, the nuke proof room or whatever. It's like a big walk in refrigerator with boxes of watches. Because the glowing hands, there's so many of them. So anyways, I'm just going to try this thing out and show you guys that it works. This is totally picking up that clock. Um, so I mean, if there's any radiation floating around, I'm going to fucking find it. And on the other, on another note, I went to our local shopper's drug mart drugstore to try and get some um, some of those iodine potassium tablets whatever they are for radiation and they're all like looking at me like I was cuckoo and said that they don't they don't have them and um, I said well yeah you guys I said you better try and get some or something I said um, there's all those spent uh, spent fuel rods in the roof of that place that blew up and I said that plutonium it doesn't just fucking you know it doesn't just disappear it blows in the wind and it lasts like 28,000 years half-life I mean it's not going anywhere so that shit's all in the air heading this way and they're all like oh oh uh, oh uh. and then one girl's like yeah I heard about that on the news and then they're kind of looking at her like oh how dare you kind of thing like and I was like well I, I don't know like fuck you know I said well whatever you know like I don't want to sound like a cuckoo and shit right but I mean it's obviously a problem that's just fucked up man nobody's covering that shit I heard them say it right on that show um, they're like yeah well the, they had spent uh, uranium rods you know whatever they are mocks um, stored up in the upper levels of that structure the reactor number three they're cooling them up in the fucking upper roof section somewhere up in the attic I guess and uh, when that thing blew up, I uh, fucking took those rods with it right into the atmosphere. So, um, I, I don't know what's worse, uh, uh, a meltdown or blowing up fucking plutonium particles. I mean, it's all bad news. So anyways, sorry about the swearing and stuff, but I've pretty well had it. I got a freaking Geiger counter now. It's talk of the day so I don't think an F word's going to hurt you right now um, anyway so yeah I got this thing and if it starts going off you guys are going to be the first to hear about it so I got this clock here as a demonstration it's, this thing works and it's sensitive enough to uh, pick up radiation so let's go into my the CB room Harsh um, spy, the spy message people. I don't know if she's on tonight.
here needs to buy a Cuban lady today. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Let's see if the uh, eagle picks up anything. Her vacuum tubes, tubes are immune, dude. Immune. Nukes can't hurt them. Anything is picking up. Frequency counter. I'm going to go over everything with this thing. My furnace. I'll check the air filter right now, even. Uh, I don't want to make this video too long. That's just a shitty filter I threw up there. There's actually another one in the furnace. But yeah, so anyways, uh, you guys see that the thing works, and uh, you'll be hearing. So, later.